My food has arrived. Hee <laughs> hee. I gotta go get it. Hey guys, it's the last day of Camp Nano. Um, so I did just get dinner. As you saw, I uh, <laughs> the DoorDash lady came and brought us dinner. We got firehouse subs for dinner. Got to support those firefighters though. And <laughs> we weren't going to order out. Um, Matt got home this afternoon, and we're like, "Oh, what do we want to do for dinner?" And he was like, well, we could do mac and cheese and hot dogs or something like chicken burgers. So I was like, yeah, yeah, that's fine. And then we realized that we forgot to get milk yesterday. <laughs> so we have no milk, so that's mac and cheese gone. And we were just kind of discussing other stuff. And he went in the other room and he came back and he goes, we're getting dort. <laughs> I was like, okay, whatever. Um, we were originally going for Chinese. And uh, apparently none of the Chinese places are open around us. So, um... Firehouse subs it is tonight. So what I have for my writing update currently, I have done about a thousand words. I am looking to do some more tonight, but I'm not really sure. I kind of am at the point where I'm like, meh, I really need to get better at Fallout because I absolutely suck at aiming and I could do with getting better for that for my other channel. So... <laughs> It's kind of a toss-up. Um, while I eat my sub, I have a meatball sub, so it's kind of messy. I think I'm going to watch some videos on YouTube and maybe maybe Netflix, I don't really know. And then once that's done, I'll see where to go from there. <laughs> so I'll check in with you guys later. So you'll never guess what I just did. Unintentionally, but you know, it worked out. I have been writing for hours and I just checked my word count. 50,000 words. <laughs> I was never going for 50,000 words. I was only going for the 40,000 because I hadn't even originally planned on going for 40,000. It was for 20,000 because I was supposed to be working all month. So just to be able to like see that, just check because I was like, okay, I'm kind of feeling like I want to be a little bit done. And I look at it and I'm like, wait, this is what? <laughs> I got 50,000? So, I'm pretty proud of that, and why are you jingling so much? Excuse me. Hello? What are you doing? Are you itching? Yeah. <laughs> anyway. So, I'm just really excited to have even been able to complete Nano. You're gonna start again now that I'm talking. Okay. <laughs> so, today has just been... Obviously a good writing day and just a weird whirlwind of a day. I spent most of the morning um, hanging out and chatting with a friend on Xbox. And then Matt got home and I was like, oh, I'll just go do my writing now. And I've just been writing for hours. Just did that and then did some writing. Food came. Ate food. Watched some um, author tubers on YouTube. And then I was like, okay, I'll just keep writing some. And... I'll write till about nine or so and see where I'm at and go from there. Well, <laughs> that's where I went. <laughs> it's 9.05 right now, so that's, if you wanted to know what time it was, I don't, I don't know. So going forward, what I plan to do with this novel is I plan on refinishing it. I am at a section where I'm adding a completely new scene, like just thought of it earlier today. So I am kind of stashing in between some other scenes and just like really building it, really like going for it. And I, that's actually why I stopped is because I was like, okay, I am getting a little like at a point in the scene of like, okay, do I go left or right or sideways or upwards or like, where can I take this? What will most make sense for the story at this point if I keep going with it? So, <laughs> that's kind of why I stopped and checked my word count. So, once I do the complete write-through, what I will be doing is I'm going to print out my novel and do a heavier edit. Really kind of take my words and be like, what are you doing here? What are you doing there? You need this here. You need this there. You can cut this. You can add this. Like, just kind of my basic how I edit. And I actually have a novel done with that edit that I need, 
like a different novel done with the editing that I do that I actually need to go through and put those edits into my document now um, just because I'm at that stage and I haven't done it yet because I got working on camp. So after I get this one into that phase, I will probably, like at that stage where I am editing it, I will probably start writing the second in between editing my other book and working on my poetry collection as well. Because that was one of my goals for 2020 was to publish that poetry collection, so I still want to be able to do that at some point. But yeah, that's where I'm going to go. I think I might actually try pub like getting a copy through either through probably Barnes and Noble Press because I don't think you have to do the whole process like Ingram Spark. You have to set it up completely. I don't know if Barnes and Noble Press you do. I will be looking into that. I looked into an approximate cost. It was like six dollars or something, not counting shipping to print and get it to me, um, whereas me going to Staples and printing off my last novel cost me like $18, so I'm pretty sure it might be more cost efficient as well, and it kind of will help me get that formatting experience in, so I'm kind of excited to do that and work on that as well in the upcoming months. Um, I've been plowing through the story, I'm so happy with where it's going, and, like, <laughs> I've already been writing scenes for, like, jotting down scene ideas, and I actually wrote another scene at work one day for one of the other books, so I'm really excited for this series, and, like I said, it's just, I really need to figure out what book eight is going to be and work on that. But, yeah, that is my goals for this novel here, just to get that out and edited this year and hopefully finish the edits and put them like into the novel obviously by the excuse me that is my plate you don't do that that's naughty yeah that was <laughs> anyway <laughs> I forgot where I was where was I oh yeah yeah I just want to be able to get those edits done and have it fully edited by the end of the year and maybe ready for betas if possible, but if not, I'm not too worried about that. I just want to get the edits done. The other one that I was talking about that I had done the edits, I do want to have ready for beta readers at the end of this year. So I might be looking for those soon, but we'll see. Anyway, uh, let me know how you all did for Camp Nano. Drop it in a comment down below. I'd love to know how you did. How many words were your goal? Did you get it? Did you go over it? Like, I went over it by almost 11,000 at this point. So, yeah. I Let me know about any of that. And if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, make sure to subscribe. I will be having another video come out in a few days. But, like, after that, it's going to, I think, depend on when my ring light comes in. Because it was supposed to come in yesterday. And it's now gotten delayed. So my next video after the one that I have already pretty much made up will completely depend on when that comes in. Because I'm I'm just tired of giving you guys like low quality videos. And I don't have the same lighting as I did in that apartment where I did like the booktube newbie tag. And it was so amazing because it was such a big window. So we will see how that goes and see where we get there. So I will see you guys all in a few days, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Bye, guys.